I'm Natalia Bonner. It's day 184. Today we're going to be stitching using my inside out machine quilting ruler. Let's get stitching. I'll start out by using my blue Mark Beyond marker and marking a T through the center of my block. From there, you'll notice on my block that I did also go and mark an increment on all four sides on that line that is one inch out from the center. From there, I'm going to begin stitching. I did start out this design by stitching in the ditch first. From there, I'll start stitching on the left side of the block and I'm going to stitch along that center marked line over across the center to the first marked point on the right side of the block. From there, I'm going to stitch point to point using the medium size curve on the 4-in-1 machine quilting ruler and stitching kind of a rounded shape in the center of the block from point to point. Once I've stitched all those, then I'm going to fill in the bottom left side of that curved space and the top right side with those fun straight line back and forth matchstick quilting. Now I've mentioned this many times before, I'm doing just matchstick quilting here because I want to stick with ruler work. But this is your design. If you want to stitch something more like pebbles or swirls, something heavy in this area, it's all about creating texture with heavy dimension. So after I've stitched and filled in those lines, then I'm going to fill in the top left corner of my block with those heavy matchstick lines, creating kind of an alternating design. Once I've stitched all the way to the top, then I'm going to travel along my marked line right through the center of the block down to the bottom where I'll stitch those straight line back and forth matchstick quilting in the bottom right corner of my block. I'll stitch that design all the way up to the center marked line where I'll stitch along that. Once I've stitched along that line, I'll spritz away those marked points and I've got an adorable quilt block design. I hope you enjoyed today's block and found a little bit of inspiration with my machine quilting. Now just remember, you can pick up the panel, the rulers, the thread, all of the notions that I'm using in this video today over on my website, peaceandquilt.com. And don't forget to share your progress pictures over on Instagram using the hashtag Let's Stitch with Natalia. That's where we will be selecting winners for weekly prizes. See you all tomorrow. Thank you.